Hey everyone, Akwaba. Welcome. We are in the beautiful country of Ghana. I'm your host for today's show. My name is Ama Jazz and you're watching The Free Up. Today my beautiful friends are joining me. I have Mame, Amarina and Kisa. And we are talking about everything and anything. You do not want to miss today's show. The topic is on returnees. Those that have returned to Ghana to live and those that have come here. Not necessarily born here. It's going to be an exciting show. You don't want to miss it. Welcome back to the Free Up. Well, my girls are here and I'm so excited. I have Mame, Amarina, and hey. Kisa. Hey, girls. Hey. Y'all look so good. Oh, well, you always do. You always do. <laughs> I, I was thinking, you know, I, like, I knew you guys were coming over and everything. And I was thinking to myself, wow, I've been in Ghana for like almost five years. Yeah. Almost five years. Like, I don't know where the time has gone. Mm -hmm. And so, Mommy, I know you're also a returnee uh -huh. to Ghana. Yeah. But you've been here a lot longer than I have, haven't I've you? I've been here, I'm going on seven. Wow. In a couple oh, of okay. months, I'm going on seven, being back. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, I came at Ghana home. I was born in Ghana. So, I've been back. So, coming back wasn't really some big exploration. I just knew that I was ready to come back. Mm -hmm. um, but seven years is it's, it's, it's Good for years. you. It's wow. Seven years, yeah. Because hmm, I'm even amazed that I've even lasted five. So to think seven, that's something. I remember I came on holiday mm -hmm. when I first met you. Mm -hmm. I came on holiday and I'm like, what? You, you shipped your car? Do you remember? Yeah. I was thinking, I what? I was one of those people when I was leaving, I was like, I'm gone. Mm -hmm. I packed everything I owned and I came back because I just wanted to fully come back. Because I feel some people come and they test in like, Three, four months, it's not for no, me. Wait, wait, wait. Mm -hmm. You don't love it anymore or what? I wasn't happy there. Or what? A lot of things like work. I just felt like work was a little stagnant. I was about to, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to show my age. I was about to turn my <laughs> age. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, I was about to turn my age and I was like, what am I doing in my life? Like, I just felt like I needed a change. I'm mean, the easiest place to start over was home. So I was like, you know, I'm going to go back to Ghana and figure this out. So mm -hmm. it, was, it was like a clear decision for me. Oh, yeah. So wow. you know me there now? I am happier here than I was there. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 big big <laughs> difference. <laughs> for me, it was a little bit different because I wasn't born here. But um, when I was a teenager, I started coming on holidays to see my cousins and my family. And so it was a slightly different decision for me. A lot of the reasons are, are the same as yours, though. I just mm -hmm. felt I needed change. I was at a, a point in my life. Um, relationships, men had a lot to do with it, too. I can't lie. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to move back. Yes, part of the reason, because I'm thinking, you know what? I need to go to my, okay, even if it's my parents' country, my country, because I feel the men will be more serious. So if hold on, okay, you hold on. <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> she asked us to hold on, so let's hold on. Please, oh. I, I thought. Okay, you my, thought. I okay. thought the men would be more serious because they're into their culture. And okay, their so families, are they serious? The question is, are they serious? My dear, I've I learned a lot. Here. <laughs> right. On. I'll we'll get into details, but mm. I learned a lot. I thought. I thought. You know, because in Canada, there's different cultures. You have the Caribbeans, the Jamaicans. The, right. And mm -hmm. I grew up in an area, I grew up with Jamaican people. I wasn't right. around Ghanaians. Okay. So I just felt like, I think my people would be more serious. I think they'd be more into family and, you know. Oh, so that's what you mean by serious. Like family, Yes, family marriage. oriented and take marriage and relationships okay. serious. Okay. So, so right. okay, if they okay, had okay, worked okay, out. Okay, okay, you thought, so what about now? You're here for five years. <laughs> oh, yes. I mean, I've experienced so much. Being okay. like. Fresh meat when I first came here. Oh, oh yes, Canadian, Ghana, Ghana guys, and I want people and the accent. I know the when accent. When I first got here, you're almost like fresh meat. Because, and plus, I went straight into the media. When I was into the entertainment Foresight, industry yeah. right away, right. and so I was exposed to like, oh, where did this one come from? She's this one is new. This one, you know. So it was. I was like, what is going on? This is nothing that I right. expected. Did you, did you experience that? Well, when I moved back, I was in a relationship already. Mm -hmm. with, no, no. In, well, with, with somebody who was Ghanaian, yes. Okay. Yeah. Living here, he was here. You know. In, 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 in between. Okay. And I was like, that, you it girls. Moved, 
in the span of four months, that blew up. Wait. It, blew up. it wasn't the same when you Wait. got there. It was completely different. Yeah. Yeah. Why? Uh-huh. Because you were now faced with the reality, yes. right? No, 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 no. That means that guy wants abroad girls. It North was, eh? You have no, localized no, yourself. Yes, <laughs> this is somebody that I met abroad. <laughs> someone abroad oh, so not gonna, I'm, 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 yeah, you're not gonna you're not gonna get yeah. the, the dollars yeah, and all that is the now dollars. cds and Even stuff she still has accent you know guys like yes yeah, but they very... want you there in the accent land not in this country like my girl they young key you. and yeah, things like that yeah you know so so now you're here with us if, if, if you look at that, if your relationship had worked out, uh-huh. like if you had met someone who was serious and all of that in Canada, but would you have come? I was out? actually with somebody in Canada, a uh-huh. great guy. He was a black American. We were together for almost two years. Okay. But I said, look, I'm just not happy. And you know, I had a great job. I had all the material things. I had my own car. I owned my own house. Okay. I was making good money. I had the material things, but spiritually. Emotionally, I was not happy. I felt like right. I was empty. Mm. But, and so I said to this guy, look, this is how I'm feeling. Right. Honestly, I want to move to Ghana. So basically I was saying to him, you either come with me or put a ring on it. And he, and he wasn't was like, about Bye. to offer any. So I said, bye-bye. I'm going. Oh. Why would I sit there and wait for a guy who uh-huh. may or may not marry you? So, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I was like, I let that relationship go, even mm. though he was cool. Mm. He was a cool it guy. He was good to you. you know? But I mean, but so I the question is, are you happy here? No. You have a family. No, I'm happy. I'm content. I'm fulfilled. I'm still there's still some things that I probably never get used to. Because you're a human. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. true. But it's, it's totally different. different. Right. Yeah, I mean, it's, true. it's totally different lifestyle. Yeah. Oh, so you came here for our men. No, no, I said <laughs> one of the reasons. <laughs> I'm, 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 no, no, no. You came here for the men. One of the reasons. Okay, I'm, one of the reasons. Uh, other reasons. And I think it's one of the me. major reasons. It was a big reason. The yeah. fact that she even but named it means it's a big it's a thing. Big one. It was a yeah. big reason. Oh, and you? Two, it, wasn't a, it wasn't a reason. She was. Me. She I, had, I, was I had a man, so I wasn't thinking about men. I was so now you have a man. I, I have a man. A Ghanaian? A Ghanaian. Oh, okay. And he's serious. I'm happy. I oh. don't complain. Okay. Oh, the the happy had like three no, wives. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not really or no. Like, <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> no, I mean, I've had a seven years. You've sampled them. You've sampled them. Okay. So, um, so the I don't think it's, it's, it's not easy, but I feel like Ghanaian men get a bit of slack. Like, it's hard to be in relationships everywhere. Yeah, I think the only true. difference is Ghana, usually the community is a little smaller. So, mm. everybody, everybody knows, knows. everybody. Yep, yep, yep. So, it's just more drama, more mm-hmm. dramatic. Mm-hmm. But I don't no, think I wouldn't agree with Ghanaian you. Ghanaian men are the, the worst. That they, they live together? Or I maybe. wouldn't agree with okay, you on okay. that because I think that it's, it's, bec- it's because of that sense of like family. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They, they take family more seriously. That's why you're feeling like it's there's drama here and it's there. It's African culture. Yes. So yeah. it, w- when you're out there, you hardly see people probably even, even hanging out with their family. So far as they live alone, they're mm-hmm. on their own. Yeah, they're with their girlfriends, well, their wives, and you know, That's kids and whatever. Right now, if I'm cooking and I need salt, I can easily go to anybody. Oh, please. Uh, mm-hmm. Oh, salt. just me. <laughs> no. Oh, it's true. Oh, no, I can't. I do that in my house. Abroad. I do that in my house. Please, which which craft is a serious it's subject? True. In oh, no, no. Africa. No, 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 no. I'm serious. Morning, I'm serious. I used to walk in the elevator to go to work. Nobody would even say good morning. Here, it's almost like a it's a everybody, everybody wants to say hi. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Right. I'm known so for that. There's certain things that are for the better, like culturally. Of course, of course. Right? Of course, of course. Culturally, there, there's a lot of things. But yeah. I think um, we have so much more to talk about. I, I still. Know, I, much I, more. I, I well, you told us that. I think mm. before we get mm. too heated, let's, mm. let's just take a short break and, and, and let's get back.